To even out the texture of my skin, I'm going to apply the Milk Blur Rosy Toned Up by Peripera. This contains SPF 50 plus and PA plus plus plus. It provides long lasting hydration to the skin and absorbs quickly and leaving the skin looking dewy and supple. This is no foundation look, but I'm gonna use a concealer by Pink Flash, and I'm I think this is in the shade number two, and I'm just gonna apply that on the parts that I want to conceal, and also I'm gonna be blending that with a wet sponge, but not really wet. I think my sponge at this time is a little bit damp, but you know it's really important to use a damp sponge when blending creams on your skin and it also creates a very natural looking skin like texture foundation or blush on your skin so better damp your sponge if you like to create a very looking dewy fresh and natural looking makeup So now I'm applying powder on the parts where I tend to crease a lot. So I'm just blotting some powders on my under eyes and also on my eyebrows because I like to keep my eyebrows mat matte before I apply my eyebrow pencil. Now I'm using two shades for my eyebrows and I'm using the lighter shade in the inner parts of my brows and then the darker shade for the outer part of my brows. I like to use bronzer to give a shade on my skin because I actually look pale and that's my insecurities because I really like to look bronze and tanned but then yeah thank god we have bronzers so I'm applying it all over my face just to give my face an illusion of having um, a slimmer face so yeah I'm applying a cream bronzer by the way and this is by Vice Cosmetics and I love this bronzer it really matches my skin tone and it blends well on my skin I also like to apply it with a sponge because I know it will look more natural if I apply it with a sponge next I'm adding blush and I really like the shade this is from uh, Peripera it's their ink airy velvet and I got the shade 25 and I really like to use this as my blush or sometimes my eyeshadow and also on my lips so uh, yeah if you see a little bit goes a long way with this shade because it is also a little bit concentrated and that's why I have to blend it also with fingers brush or even sponge because I don't want to make my I don't want to make the makeup look very pinkish because as you can see I look like parang sinampal <laughs> so yeah blend it very well to make it look more natural highlighter is the key for this look so I'm applying the highlighter just on the temples of my cheeks and also on the tip of my nose because I don't want to make it look exaggerated with some highlighters so enough lungs the cheeks and also on my nose and we all know we cannot complete the look without mascara so whether this is a natural or glam or just an everyday makeup look mascara is always there and mascara is a must for my lips i like to keep the look um, monochromatic so i'm just applying the same shade as i apply on my uh, cheeks 
but I want to add a little gloss and more color so I'm applying the glowy tint and still by Peripera because this is very very beautiful color and I really like the shade of this and it also gives the look very juicy So that is the complete look for our glowy and dewy pinkish natural makeup look and I hope you guys enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet and yeah thank you guys and I'll see you on my next video bye